Hey there, folks! I'm thrilled to bits to spill the beans on a total game changer in the display arena, the Dasung Paperlike HD. I've been putting this baby to the test with my creative gigs, and after just a few days, my peepers are thanking me. It's like it's giving my severe dry eye a much needed break. Let me take you back a bit. Way back when, I had this 6 inch e ink reader, which now seems so vintage, and all it did was books. But check this out the Dasung e ink monitor. It's a whopping 13.3 inches, a four paper size, baby. My old reader, it's like a mini me compared to this beast. I just slap this bad boy onto my laptop and voila, I've got myself an e-ink laptop. It's the bomb, I tell ya. Let me tell you what really blew my mind about this revolutionary e-ink monitor, its refresh rate. Now, I'm not a tech wizard or anything, but I put it to the test with a website to see just how fast it could go. The official word is that it's 40 hertz, and I gotta say, you can see for yourself as I'm moving the mouse around and browsing the web. The refresh is seriously snappy, and the mouse glides so smoothly, it's pretty impressive stuff. Let's take a closer look at how it handles text. The display is super crisp, you know? It's got a different vibe from my old reader, but it's still crystal clear. Oh, and the front light feature? Daesung offers a bunch of color options for the front light, but I gotta say, I'm a stickler for the white light. It just feels more comfortable on the eyes, especially when I'm using it at night. It's super handy. But during the day, I sometimes switch off the front light and go au naturel with it. Gotta hand it to Dasung, these guys are seriously creative when it comes to e-ink monitors. I mean, they were the pioneers, the ones who invented the e-ink monitor game. I'm really looking forward to seeing if they can pull off a full-on e-ink laptop in the future. Until then, I'm gonna make the most of my paper-like HD, the revolutionary edition. That 40 hertz refresh rate is just mind-blowing. All right, that's all for today's share. I might drop some more in-depth thoughts later on, so stay tuned for that.